All right, if you watched my video that I posted yesterday on my channel, I talked about two bugs that users are experiencing with Final Cut Pro. One being audio skimming, not playing back when you move the arrow keys one at a time. We're not gonna focus on that in this video. We're gonna focus on the major bug that I'm experiencing and a few others in the comments have been experiencing across all the Apple Silicon Macs. The issue is when you're trying to adjust something in the viewer, an element that is in the viewer, it's causing Final Cut Pro to freeze or hang. It's not causing the spinning wheel, it's not causing Final Cut to crash, it just sort of freezes. So you can see here I've got this diagnose text. If I wanna just edit the text and I try to double click it, Final Cut Pro freezes and hangs. If we right click on the application, you'll see it eventually pop up as application not responding. Now you can manipulate the elements in the inspector, but a lot of us are using motion VFX plugins, different plugins where some of the things that we need to do, you can only do in the viewer. So this is a major issue, but I've had a breakthrough and we can credit the old Apple Mighty Mouse that I picked up at a thrift store for $2 in helping to diagnose the issue. Now you might be saying, what does a mouse have to do with a bug in Final Cut Pro? I was thinking the exact same thing. So in the comments on the video that I posted yesterday, a lot of people have been having the same issue and we've ascertained that it seems to be revolving around my good friend, the magic trackpad and the trackpad, I don't have it next to me, the trackpad on our laptops. Why would this be causing Final Cut Pro to freeze? Your guess is as good as mine, but we can see that Final Cut is still frozen from what I was trying to do earlier with the Magic Trackpad. So let's run a little test. All right, so the first thing that we're gonna do in this little experiment is we're gonna turn off the trackpad, make sure that that's completely disconnected from the Mac. And then I'm gonna plug in my Mighty Mouse. I've got a USB A dock here on my edit bay and we're all connected. So let's launch Final Cut Pro and see if we can do these manipulations with the Mighty Mouse. Spoiler alert, I already know the answer, but if you're hanging on the edge of your seat, great you're gonna see what's going on here. So let's load our project for the demo. And I've got a project here. Man, it's weird using a mouse, especially this, the, the Mighty Mouse. You can use that little gray ball on it to still scroll your timeline, that's incredible. Okay, so we have our text tool. Guess what, when I double click, works no problem. If I try to resize something, let's scale this down. Works no problem, all good. The minute I turn the trackpad on though, and I'll be curious if it does this with the mouse connected. Let's get the magic trackpad up and running. The minute I try to manipulate this, oh, is it already frozen? It's already frozen. Just connecting froze it. So yeah. Okay, well let's force quit. All right, so we've got this. Nope, okay, so that works. Now let's try it with the trackpad. All right, so the trackpad is connected. I'm able to move everything. Frozen. This is one of the weirder ones I've ever experienced, but somehow the trackpad input for Final Cut Pro is causing issues. All right, so in continuing to try to diagnose this issue, or at least zero in on what specifically with the trackpad is tripping this up, I'm playing around in the accessibility settings and system settings. So if we open system settings and just search for trackpad, and then go to accessibility and trackpad options. Now someone in the comments in the previous video mentioned that if you turn off use trackpad for dragging, you can start to use the trackpad again in Final Cut Pro. So if we click here, which unfortunately is being is freezing still with the text tool, but let's try dragging. So if we wanna resize this and get Shift T, and then let's reduce this down to 50%, we can resize if we turn off use trackpad for dragging. So there's some progress there, but unfortunately, when we try to use the trackpad, again, for text manipulation, Final Cut freezes. So this is not a solution, but it's just a little bit more information on what is going on with Final Cut Pro as it relates to the trackpad. I know that everybody who is having this bug isn't running things like Command Post and some of the secondary apps that I'm running. So I don't know if this is a Final Cut Pro bug or if this is something related to Mac OS. I have a feeling it is Final Cut Pro related because I'm able to use the Magic Trackpad no problem in all the other apps in Mac OS. Apple, if you have any updates that you're gonna push out anytime soon, like a 10.8.1, or if someone can 
reply in the comments with some additional troubleshooting steps now that we've identified not necessarily the root cause of this issue, but what is initiating this freeze in Final Cut Pro. It seems to revolve around the Magic Trackpad. So that's it. That is the next stage in the diagnosis problem of this issue. Again, if anybody has any comments about this that might be some troubleshooting steps or additional information, please let me know. Uh, again, I'm experiencing this on my Mac Studio with the Magic Trackpad and on my M1 Pro MacBook Pro with the trackpad there, but I'm not experiencing it when using a mouse on my M2 Pro Mac Mini. And of course, I'm not experiencing it when I use the old Mighty Mouse. And that's a little bit of a pro tip. If you are someone who likes troubleshooting issues with your computers, I highly recommend grabbing uh, a plug-in mouse for your computer. It doesn't have to be a Mighty Mouse. I found two of them at a thrift store and I keep them around when I need to troubleshoot Bluetooth issues or any other issues with my computers or old computers. But this was a very valuable tool in trying to diagnose what is causing Final Cut to freeze when you're manipulating items in the viewer. So that's it. I'm gonna get going on editing this video so you all can respond and tell me what you think. Final Cut Pro 10.8, not perfect, a little buggy for everybody. Thanks for dropping all of your comments in my other video, which I'll link here in the end um, on an end card. But that's all I've got for this one. Till the next one, I'll see y'all soon. Don't forget, keep chopping that broccoli if Final Cut Pro will let you when you're using the Magic Trackpad. Mm -hmm.